Hello everyone, Chocolate Birds here for another video review. This time we have the limited edition Terry's Chocolate Orange Bar Cranberry. Yeah, so very uh, unusual this one. You don't normally get um, cranberry limited editions. It's usually raspberry or strawberry or mint or I don't know, something weird like salted caramel. Well, not weird, but you know, typical, I guess, or you know, a flavour that's not, you know, I don't know, like a. Yeah. I don't know, like New York cheesecake or something like that, you know what I mean? <laughs> but cranberry, very different, very different, yeah. So thanks very much to Andrew Winter for pointing this one out, and the Scotty as well. Yeah, so very, um, yeah, great for the tip-offs, thank you. And um, yeah, very excited about this one. I quite like the uh, the new um, sort of, well, I guess I wouldn't say new, but they've done a sort of, this. well, Terry's have been taken over, basically. I mean, is it, um, the ownership's passed on to someone else, really. I can't think who it's called now. Um... I don't think it says on here, but basically they've got a new owner in there and it seems to be doing more with the bar. So they brought out, um, you know, Andrew was explaining uh, in the comments that they're basically doing this, you know, they're just sort of re not re -run, reinvigorating, I think you'd say, the, the range of chocolates. So they've they have produced this bar sort of version, this bigger bar version, and they're reintroducing the, or they're bringing out, I don't, I don't think, probably as a limited edition, but the white chocolate, uh, Terry's chocolate orange as well this winter. So very much looking forward to that. Um, Say winter, probably out next month <laughs> in September, but we'll see. So yeah, but um, in the meantime, they brought this one. And as I say, it stands out a lot, doesn't it? It's very unusual, you know, cranberry. And um, I'm glad they've done something a bit different rather than just do salted caramel or, as I say, something like that or fudge brownie or something. You know, they've done something very different. It's really unusual, really. And, you know, just fingers crossed that it does pay off and it's nice. But as I say, it is a limited edition one, so it's not going to be there forever. But, um, hmm, interesting. So what does it say? Peel to open, made of real orange oil. A bit weird that one because of I mean, how much, you know, one drop. <laughs> it says, milk chocolate flavoured with real orange oil and cranberry juice from concentrate pieces, 10%. Okay, so, hmm, interesting. Um, it's a 90 gram bar. It's got, um, it's segmented per five segments, 20 grams, 101 calories, 5.1 grams of fat, 3.2 of which are saturates. Uh, per 100 grams, so you take off 10%, that'd be 90 grams, so 507 calories. Uh, 26 grams of fat, 16 of which are saturates. Yeah, so it's probably just about, mm, yeah, yeah. It's unusual because the segments in this one aren't equal, so it's very difficult with giving the segments basically what what to expect, so I don't know. But it looks very nice. I mean, it seems a bit weird that they've got this. <laughs> anyway, it's, it's got cranberry fruit juice concentrate, so maybe it makes a bit more sense. It's got this sort of like weird, looks a bit like the Fanta or Tango logo here. Um, <laughs> but, um, yeah, it still seems a bit odd, I think, you know, yeah. So you can see on the back as well, made of real orange oil. There we go. But it looks very nice. It does look very nice. Yeah. I don't think, yeah, okay. It's got, you can see their segments as well, like big, not segments, but we can see the segments, but you can see it's got big uh, sort of pieces of cranberry in there. So does it actually say that? Um, cranberry juice from concentrate, but yeah, but it looks like it's got some chewy, or at least crunchy cranberry pieces if you look at that there. So interesting. Well, not cranberry pieces, but I don't know. Stuff that's, I don't know, flavoured like cranberry, <laughs> which is interesting. Okay, well, I think there's not much more to say. Very excited for this one, definitely, so let's give it open. <laughs> let's do it. Yeah, come on, so we're going to give this uh, limited edition Toast Chocolate Orange Bar with cranberry uh, an open, so let's do it. So it's got some flourishes on the sides, on the top. So let's see uh, what we've got now. So with the flourishes, the uh, knife is 18.5. Peel to open, which is quite nice. <laughs> Sounds a bit like a fruit. Okay, so it's quite good. So some of them don't peel open like this very easily anymore. Okay, so I have been quite melting UK lately, and it has melted a bit. Let's be careful as I open it. So I forgot what it was now. What was it 20? 18.5, wasn't it? So what have we got now? Yeah, I had problems last time I reviewed one of these actually. <laughs> It is an odd shaped chocolate bar, it's sort of segmented as I say, so yeah, it's about 15.3 now centimeters. So you can see on the back, see how it's sort of melted on the sides. But you can see as well this sort of weird torpedo top shape. There's very interesting smell coming from it. Hmm, well, obviously chocolate orange, but there's definitely something else I caught in there as well. And there you go, you can see. Sort of nice segments, but you can see how uneven it is as well. You know, each each of these segments are not the same size. You can see the bottom two say Terry's, but the rest of them don't. So not all the same. So if you split off some of these segments, they wouldn't all be the same. It's not really segmented as such. 
and that's why the calories don't quite work out. So it's a bit unusual, a bit difficult to work out the calories there. Okay, so let's roughly work out the uh, measurements. So, yeah, about 7.6 across, height wise, so for, you know, roughly about 0.5 centimeters, but it does raise up to about 0.7 in places. Yeah, maybe 0.8. It's quite hard to measure actually. Yeah, about 0.8. So, yeah, it's a bit melty, but um, yeah. But you know you can snap it quite cleanly down the middle, which is good. But as I say, you know these segments. Yeah, you know, that is that a segment. You know what I mean? That's how it's snapped. You know, but then it's half, halfway through that one. So you know, you know what I mean? It doesn't. You can't do it really. You know, it doesn't work. But yeah, hmm. a nice smell. We can see there. There's that sort of cranberry piece there coming through. Which is really nice looking. Yes, but it's not quite as. Uh, <laughs> Is there, I don't know. Can you see on the front there? Can you see? Can you see that? I'm trying to see. I don't know if you can see. We can. Not quite as populous with uh, <laughs> cranberry pieces as that one. Of course, that piece. But you could see. Hopefully, you could see that anyway. Uh, let's try some of us. But you know, this one's a bit better. So you can see that one there. Quite a lot of cranberry pieces. Not so yeah. So you know. Hmm. You can see, I, I can't quite tell if you can see that, but hopefully you can. So, yeah, not too bad. It was quite similar, similar enough anyway. Hmm. Yeah, so there we are. Hmm, very excited for these ones. But I say, it's been a bit, sort of, been a bit uh, warm in the UK lately, um, so it's a bit soft. It's quite cold. It's, it's a normal temperature now in my house, but I think uh, the heat's been quite residual, so yeah. So, not too bad on the census, though. As I say, some of them, this is probably as close to a segment as you're going to get an actual segment of orange. You can see the sort of nice orange seg you know, like, you know, pattern on there. Looks a bit like an orange segment as well, which is quite nice. Um, yeah, I say it's been melting a bit though, so my fingerprints are on it a bit, but it's not too bad. Well, then the bottom one I have to say, but that's probably got my fingerprints on it now as well. <laughs> okay, I think we should uh, give this a taste then. Yep, let's do it. <laughs> Looking forward to this one very much. <laughs> okay, I'm once again give this a limited edition Terry's Chocolate Orange Bar with cranberry a taste. Um, yeah, it's a very exciting one. It's got like basically cranberry sort of pieces inside. Well, not cranberry pieces, but pieces that represent cranberry. <laughs> um, yeah, some of them, you know, some sections or some, sort of, yeah, seems to have more and more pieces of cranberry than others. Um, see here, these two quite similar. Really. They might be, yeah, you know, quite a bit of bit of it there you can see but um, some of them when I've broke them in half yeah like this one this one you know but it's hard to say really you know it's different size segments and things so I just have to see but uh, yeah if you should give it a taste so hmm. but you know typically on the front it's got one with quite a lot of pieces in <laughs> you can see that there those pieces but you know so not all quite like that but um, yeah okay right it's not done in the middle actually, just to see. Yeah, so it's still in the middle, so it's quite, they are, I mean, you know, they are quite filled with, quite well filled with cranberry pieces. Yeah, you know, no, I think they're successful, it's good enough, definitely. <laughs> okay, right. Let's give one these a taste, let's do it. Hmm. Hmm. Lots of orange. Chocolate orange taste, but um, hmm, very strong uh, other flavour though. Hard to taste the cranberry. I've had cranberry juice before, and it's always been a bit bitter for me. Hmm. It tastes really nice, actually. Hmm. This has got the sort of, sort of um, chocolate orange taste, but um, hmm, which is like a sort of sharp. Semi sharp, um, a very fruity taste. It tastes a bit, as I say, a bit like, um, well, I assume cranberries, but it's not bitter like cranberries normally are for me, or at least the cranberry juice I've tasted. Um, it just has a bit of a, yeah, a bit of a, hmm, raspberry, strawberry, cranberry, hmm, <laughs> flavours. It's very nice actually, and the, um, and these sort of pieces, hmm, it's not hard. And you don't really, you can just about taste them, a bit like a sugary consistency, a bit like a, 
กี่เหนือว่าอืมเนี่ยอะไรกันอืมเป็นอะไรกันเนี่ยเดี๋ยวไงพอดีไงเลย like a very very soft อืม like a very soft fruit pastel you know very soft you know very just um hmm Essentially, yeah, very soft fruit pastel type consistency. Hmm, really nice actually. It's a really nice bar. This hmm, big surprise. It works really well. The two flavors together. Hmm, I must say, and I like the um those little cranberry sugary pieces. Hmm, really nice. I really like this. And the flavors seem to work together as well, which I was a bit surprised about. I thought, you know, sort of, you know orange flavored chocolate with something else. How's that going to work? And it does, though. Hmm. Hmm. This is really surprisingly nice. I mean, it's if anything, you'd say it's a chocolate orange that's sort of a bit too powerful. Um, you know, a bit too sickly tasting. It's just a bit too rich and. Um, You know, hmm. But it's not. But you know, hmm. That's the way it's always been with Terry's chocolate orange. Though it's just the same as usual. Hmm. No, I really like these. It's um. I think the the cranberry. I mean, you know, it's. I'm not had cranberry loads, as I say. I've never, never had just a cranberry. <laughs> I mean, you know, but I've had cranberry juice and everything, and I think it's usually been a bit bitter for me. But these ones taste really nice. It's just a, a little bit of a. A sharp fruity taste, and it could really be anything—a strawberry, raspberry, or something. Um, but you know, clearly a, a sort of berry of sorts. You know, it's only a red berry. Um, it does have that taste to it. So you could say, "Oh well, I'm not really sure it is a cranberry." I mean, I'm not a cranberry expert, so I can't say for sure. Um, mm. But it's a nice little sugary, let's say, a very soft pastel type consistency. There's no chew there really, but. Mm. There's no chew or anything, just a slight softness. Mm, a bit almost like you've got like a bit of sugar, like um, a little clump of sugar together. So that's probably more. How oh, it is? I'd say very soft pastel, but uh, it's just really nice. And the chocolate's nice as well. It's nice and um, mm, soft and a lovely flavour of um, let's say Terry's chocolate orange there. Hmm. No, it just works really. It just works really nicely. I'd say if anything, you could probably say that the. The chocolate orange is the weak part, you know, just because it's a bit too acidic, you know. You can feel it a bit being a bit too acidic, you know, and then you, <clears throat> you know, just if you had a couple of segments. But I do like it a lot, and I don't think you're meant to eat quite as much as I have now. <laughs> mm. But you know, it does taste really nice, and I really like those sort of consistency of those pieces. As I say they are quite a bit like eating them, almost like having a bit of sugar in there, you know. But it's, but it's that between that and a bit of a pastel taste. So it's a very soft. It's a fruit pastel type taste, a really soft, as soft as you could get without it being just non-existent. You know, um, mm. but, uh, it's all lovely. You know, so you might think it was because it's cranberry, it might be a bit, um, mm, not you know, just something a bit not quite amazing. But mm, no, it could be any red berry really. I think you know, it's well, it's not really strawberry or raspberry, flavor, as I say, but you can tell it's a red berry of some kind. I don't think you can really tell it's cranberry, but um. Hmm. It says it's made from cranberry juice, so you know maybe you can. But I think for me, it was always a bit bitter. But I definitely prefer this taste and what I remembered of cranberry anyway. Um. Hmm. No, I'm really, really like this one. It's uh, yeah, I think a five out of five. I really like it. It's just such a nice, different. The flavors just work really well together. And there's that, you know, the, the orange of chocolate is really nice, and there's a sort of cranberry, sort of sugary pieces in there. You know, you can see a couple there. Just really, um, just really taste. You know, they're very subtle, but they just taste nice. Um, and there's a lot of them, even though sometimes you can't. You know, you get things like this where there seems to be one in them. Um, but they're definitely there and they're definitely present. Um, I say this one here, it's a bit more filled, and I think that's probably more typical of it. But yeah, I'm really, really happy with these. I think they're really nice. It's just a definitely a surprise. Well, it's just a set of combination of flavors I really didn't think. Would really taste particularly nice or work together as well because I said the chocolate orange is quite strong and it is strong, um, both in sort of taste and acidity really. But it just seems to, 
but the but the cranberry sort of pieces seem to sort of get through that taste and add their own little you know their own little twist and little touch to the uh mm. to the bar and it just really works mm. and I, I really recommend this one it's really nice really different um mm. no five out of five for sure very nice. <laughs> like a lot. I'm looking forward to seeing what else they do as well under this new ownership because they're doing some, you know, just just they're not doing anything ridiculous. They're just just releasing, you know, say this of this product, just something a bit different, you know. And um, they said the white chocolate orange in the Christmas in, around Christmas time, I think. Um, made a sort of bigger bar as well. You know, they just seem to be doing sensible things really and do something interesting and uh, mm, and I like it. I really like it. I think it's good. <laughs> Step in the right direction for sure. Um, so we'll see where it goes. <laughs> okay, guys. Well, thanks for watching. Follow me on Instagram, Twitter, Patreon if you can. Leave comments on it. It's always great to hear from you. It really is. Um, and subscribe if you haven't already, as I say. And um, yeah, I'll see you next time. <laughs> thanks again, guys. Take care. Bye for now. Have a lovely day. Bye. <laughs>